Ross, welcome to, to Barnet Football Club. Uh, how's it feel to be here? Yeah, no, it feels great. Um, just pleased it's all done now and uh, just looking forward to uh, the weekend. You've joined on, on a loan deal until the end of the season from, from Steamridge. Can, can you tell us uh, how, it, how it came about? Um, well, it come around, come around quite quick, to be fair. Um, last night, I just uh, had um, talks with Dean, um, all positive chats. Um, and then, yeah, just weighing up everything and it was the best option really to come in. What was it about Barnard that, that made you want to sign here? Well, there's a lot of things I think. Um, obviously, we all know that it's not in a position where it wants to be. Um, and it, it's, it's a renowned big club in the National League and, and pushing into the league. And, and, and that's something that I want to be a part of and, and to push this club as, as high as it can go. The talks with Dean, um, straight away just just welcomed me and, and it was all positive and obviously I know um, Paoli and, and Hawley as well um, from from their time at, at Stevenage in, in pre-season so uh, yeah no it's, it's always good knowing a few a few faces going into a dressing room because obviously it can be quite daunting but um, no all, all the lads have welcomed me today and, and it's been all positive so yeah. You came through the, the uh, academy at Ipswich and, and have since had spells at uh, Lower Stoff, Braintree and, and, and Maidstone. What, what was that like for you and how do you feel like that, that might have helped you uh, sh- shape, shape your game and shape you as a player? Mm. Yeah, no, I think, I think that's just a big part to things going out and, and experiencing first team football, you know, um, for me as well. It's something that I've always wanted to do and, and just get a taste of things and, and I think that puts you in good stead really for to, to going on and and managers trusting you more and having that experience behind you and, and that's the main thing really that, that, that I've got out of it is, is going there and, and playing games and, and getting more minutes under your belt. You've already touched on it already but what are the, uh, what are the conversations been like with Dean Brennan? <laughs> All positive, he's, uh, he, he's a funny man so uh, no, he's, uh, he's class obviously had the phone calls last night, um, he's just speaking about the club and and how he wants it going forward and things like that. It's, it's all positive. It, it was definitely something that I wanted to be a part of, 100%. And can you uh, describe yourself as a, as a player for, for those who, who might not know a lot about you? Yeah, so uh, I can play centre-half or, or in the midfield in a holding role. Um, I feel like I've got an eye for a pass. Um, definitely can can cover the spaces and get around the pitch and, and be dominant in the 1v1s and, and just get things going forward, really. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm an aggressive player, I would like to say. Um, but yeah, no, definitely just coming in and, and just wanting to, uh, to wherever, wherever I play, I'm, I'm, I'm going to do my best. So, yeah. What are you looking to, to get out of this loan move from, from a personal level and, and, for, and for the club as well? No, listen, the, the main thing for me is, is, is to come in and play games, you know. Um, it's, it's something I've, I've been lacking this season um, which has been a little bit disappointing um, but, but obviously that's football and, and that's what happens and I'm just pleased to be here now and, and hopefully I can just put in the good performances help the team push up and uh, yeah just get games under my belt again